Okay, I've just put these two girls in this other paddock. So they're right next to Cleo and the other horses because Bonnie's going in a few days and I'll just slip Ruby across and then that way it'll be less traumatic for them all. They're all right on top of each other. The other paddocks run out of uh, water source. So um, they're next to each other. They're, not, they're wearing out a certain, uh, like a patch in the other paddock. Um, which I'll stop doing and I can get an electric fence set up there to, for when uh, I use it again and they're, they're pretty good so that's good I'll miss Bonnie but after the stress of losing a horse I can't bear uh, the responsibility of anyone else's horses if anything happened to her I just wouldn't even begin to know what to say to her owner um, it's bad enough when it's your own horse but just to break the news to somebody that you know if anything happened to their horse um, you know, one minute she's healthy and then she's dead. So it happened so quickly, it gave me a big lesson. So in the next couple of days, we'll have some goodbye videos of Bon and um, Tuppy's doing well. And they're in a paddock that's got uh, a hill and some rocks up there. These girls can handle it. They're galloping up and down the other hill. So was Cleo, but then she's going lame. So Cleo is now officially relegated to this paddock for life, well, until we move. And she's with Penny and she's got to have a flat paddock uh, whether she likes it or not so uh, Ruby loves Tuppy so Ruby will just come across so they've got all this just avoiding my son there uh, all this fence line in common so they can all be together um, see each other be a herd but with the fence to keep them safe uh, because these two big girls here are more likely to injure the other horses because they're big and powerful and more dominant which is fine, that's that's normal. And so um, it was good a good a good transition to what was a very sad day yesterday and just, just a sad ending to the year in general, sad ending to a darling life. Okay.